What's up guys? It's your boy P Dog here. It's Tuesday, it's beautiful outside. I just got home from work and I'm kind of fucking hungry, so I'm gonna make some food and I'm gonna do a brew review. Today, I'm gonna make, I found these the other day at the grocery store, right? And I was like, I'm gonna give them a shot, why not? They're these little pandonk paganda things and there's some pork pop stickers. And I've already tried before, I've already made them before, but I just wanted to share with everybody else because they were actually pretty banging and they're super easy to make. So I was like, why not just do a video of me making them and then show everybody and they can buy some and make them themselves. And then all in the process, I can try another beer that nobody's ever, well, I guess, not that anybody's ever seen before, but like nobody's tried, not even me. And it's a little different from what I'm usually used to, but it's something I've actually acquired a taste for lately uh, because I'm sophisticated as fuck. And then, um, and we're gonna give it a shot. So let's, um, Let's hop on, let's, let's switch the camera around and then get to it, all right? And we'll do some camera effects, all right? All right, guys, so basically they're super easy to make. All you need is like like a fourth of a cup of water, and this is a cup, and I think I, it's a little bit third, but I'm pretty sure if it was a measuring cup, it'd be a, it'd be a fourth. <clears throat> so you pour that into a pan that's at medium heat or medium high heat, and then you pour like a tablespoon of oil in it, and then you pretty much go from there. But I, it's honestly all just guessing because I don't have any measuring tools, so. Pretty much just eyeball this bad boy, but I think it's hot enough now. Um, so you do this part. Oh yeah, there's a little bit of steam. So you do this part, all right? And then you gotta cover it and let it sit for 10 to 11 minutes. And I'm gonna be honest with you, I did it for 11 minutes last time and burnt the bottoms of them. Still ate them, but I, I did burn the bottom of them a little bit. Um, so I'm gonna go with 10 this time and we're gonna see what happens, okay? They come in a little bag too, so you know they're authentic. All right, let's cut these mother of them. Also, it says on the bag, you're supposed to put the flat side down flat, obviously. Okay, and if you look at these bad boys, you see there, there's like a flat side, you put this side down, okay? This, oh, duh, warm water don't mix, stupid. I'm over here trying to mix, <laughs> stupid. All right, let's give it a shot, okay? Put them all face down. Already smells like burning oil. I think I put too much water in this one this time. Dude, I'll never make these right, I swear. Okay, and then you put the top on them. I got the fan going so I don't burn my, or smoke out my apartment. Um, I'm gonna put a timer on for 10 minutes this time. All right, that's how we're doing it. And then we're gonna let it sit. And while that sits, let's go ahead and do a brew review, okay? Let's go to my living room. More camera effects. Well, here we are guys, we're in my living room, all 10 feet away from where we're making. Everything's cooking over there, it's smoking quite a bit. That vent doesn't work that well, but it's fine. So anyway, today I'm going to try something a little different, I'm not really used to. Um, I can't remember if I, I'm pretty sure I've done um, one of these before, but today I'm doing, um, I'm doing a new Belgian, it's part of their up next series okay i'm pretty sure i've done one of those before um and it's called a peach kick all right i like the can real simple white peaches on it like it um it's slightly sour peach ale and i that's what i was saying over there was it's something different than i don't usually do that often um which is sour sour beers and honestly lately i've kind of acquired a taste for them and i don't know where that's coming from because i always drink light beer but for some reason sour beer is starting to you know really cleanse the palate a little bit all right really really put some kick in my life um so <laughs> so this one is 4.2 percent alcohol it's from new belgium um sour ale with peach with peach peach essence and lemon so peaches are good i like lemons um i'm assuming that's where the sour comes from um but let's give it a shot. I think this was, this was, uh, it was a six pack can. Um, and I think it was on sale for $9.99. I think it's usually $10.99. I don't know. I think so. That might be what it is. Let's give it a shot. All right. Oh, it smells like a beer. I mean, I don't, it's what I said. It wasn't ale. I mean, it smells, doesn't smell like peaches, but let's see if it's peaches. If everything's peaches. Peaches and cream.
that's pretty tasty right there. It's not sour like most sours. I mean, this one, like, there's a little bit of like, yeah, when you first try it, but low key, this one's pretty fucking good. I am super impressed. I like it a lot. Holy shit. So sorry about the interruption. I don't know what happened. A little bit of camera issues, a little bit I had to run and go check on everything, make sure that he's working over there. But like I was saying, the peach in this, you can taste it. It's not too strong. I mean, the sour's not overpowering. Um, I got um, some lawn workers walking by my back window looking at my cats, um, which are looking adorable right now, by the way. But um, this beer is honestly very good. I like it. I like it a lot. It's not very, it's not gonna be a, a very fall or like wintery drink, but over the summertime, this one this one could get it. I mean, this one could get it. If I had to rate it, if you like sours, you like this a lot. If you don't like sours, you still might like it a lot. It's really not that bad. Um, I don't really know what to compare it to, but it's honestly the sour in it is not what you think it is. If I had to, if I had to judge this one or rate this one. Me personally, I'm thinking about 7.8 to 8. I'm somewhere not somewhere not range. I think this is good. I like. I want everybody to try this one. I know I said it every time, but I, fuck y'all. Probably y'all even tried anyway. So whatever. Y'all don't usually half my friends don't try this. I fucking have it. So fuck y'all. It's fine. Whatever. Fucking love y'all. Fuck y'all. Um. So honestly though, if you see this one, this is good. I got it at the tea. Uh, but it's New Belgian. Peach Kick, part of their Up Next series. Really good, like it, enjoy it. Um, 7.8 to 8, take your pick. I mean, it's honestly, it's up there. That might be a little bit generous. I'm kind of thinking of people that don't like sours that might think I'm crazy for trying this. So, but all around, good beer. This is a good choice. Now, it's time for my pop stickers to be done, okay? I probably got probably another five minutes. I'm just kidding, it ain't that much. We've been talking for longer than that. Probably three minutes. So, um, let's uh, let's see how we did on that one. All right, let's see how we did. Wait, I know you're on the fucking count. Wait, I know you're on the counter. I'll be back. So guys are done. Um, they smell burnt. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. So, these will not be edible. How, what am I fucking I doing wrong? Bro, this is why I don't cook. You understand? I bought another box of these bitches last night for this fucking reason. In case I burnt, you can see the burnt one. Look at, well, I don't, you can, they're all burnt, but like, <laughs> what the fuck? Bro, look at this. <laughs> fuck, I hate cooking, dude. I fucking hate it. This shit sucks, dude. These are good though. The other night I did them and it wasn't that burnt. Get these, try them, dude. <sighs> fucking Bon Appetit trash can. This is bullshit. Guys, go try the fucking beer. I didn't fuck the beer up, okay? Go try the beer. I'm good at that. I'm good at that kind of entertainment. All right, this is... What the fuck do you want? Anyway. What a fail. This was a this was a failed one, all right? All the other times I did good, and this time I gotta fuck it up. Oh, it's something easy. I didn't even make these. Like, I literally did hardly anything. Maybe I made it too high. I think I had it too high. I think I had it on eight. It probably needs to be like a good six. Maybe I'll try cooking them again tonight, later on. I'm over this. This is bullshit. Guys, I don't have a beer. I'm literally just a mess right now. 7.8 to 8. Peach Kick. New Belgian. Up next series. Try it, guys. Get some cores while you're at it, too. Cleanse the palate. Remember that, guys. See ya!